Um, okay, so I'm back here again, and we are going to unwrap the legs. And that is actually a very, very simple process here, uh, as it's just it's going to be as simple as the arms, basically. So let's just open up this little view here that we set up in the first part of this video tutorial. Well, not the first part of this, but the torso UV mapping. So let's select the legs here. Let's uh, actually select them. Uh, and if I, if you don't know, I have actually gone through all of these commands and things in my torso unwrapping uh, and partially my uh, arm unwrapping tutorials, so you might want to check those out. So here we go, the UVs are all messy again because we haven't laid them out yet, so let's just create a planar map for us to start, uh, to start with. Um, I always like to create a planar map as it is, uh, it is very simple, it's, it just uh, removes all of the unnecessary um, let's display texture borders here. Uh, this, all the unnecessary seams, basically, that you don't want. Uh, so for the legs here, let me see. I am going to split it up into two separate pieces. So let's select this edge right here, and then select these two right here, and grow those. So now you have these selected, which are the center inside the legs and the one down the center here. And let me just cut those by going to edit UV, cut UV edges. And uh, let's just keep these where they are. Let me keep at least that one where it is. So now, inverse that section, uh, unwrap them. Now you can see that we actually have. Actually, let's just never mind. Let's select everything, not pin anything, and unwrap it. We have two separate pieces here. Um, and this piece, I believe, is actually upside down. Because this is um, yes, it is upside down. So let's take this one and rotate it by pressing this, which will rotate it like that, which is pretty nice. Uh, and also, let me do what I did before: take these two, or actually let's take this one, move it out somewhat like that, and then maybe pin that one, that one, and that one maybe, and select everything and unwrap. That will make it huge. So now we can see that these are very similar now. Uh, so, but we have two separate pieces here, so that means that we will have to UV this part and UV this part and ma make them match up seamlessly, which is very <coughs> uh, texture in this part and texture in this one. Uh, and make them look as they are seamless, which they aren't in real life. And that is very difficult, <coughs> actually. So, uh, actually, I believe this is supposed to be. Let me just see here if I select this edge. Okay, good. Uh, so to do that, we'll actually merge these two pieces together because that will uh, help us to create one piece. So to do that, I will actually um, let me see how I want to do this here. Let's just select all of these, um, which all those basically. Uh, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one, that one. Sure, we will select them now. And let's just press the move and so icon here to move them and uh, sew them together. Oh, never mind, actually. That's. Hmm. How will I do this? Uh, I might actually just keep it like this to have one piece to two separate pieces because I'm not sure if I really want to not have them because they look right here which technically I could merge them together right here uh, which I guess I could let's try that let's try that for now uh, so I press move and so like this let's just rotate it around a bit by taking the rotated item here and uh, let me just enlarge this area a bit and take that one uh, I'm going to take that, then that, and inverse that, and unwrap it. And yeah, that's actually pretty good. Now we have the legs all out, unwrapped, basically. And uh, we have as little seams as we can have for the moment. And all of the uh, squares are square. So that's pretty much it for this tutorial. Uh, thanks for watching. And this will be the last part of the unwrapping process because. It is actually really simple with just an organic model like this. It is simple, but if you have armor pieces and uh, mechanical pieces, it gets a lot more advanced as you go on.
that's pretty much it. So, thanks for watching. Uh, I hope hope you comment, rate. Um, so yeah, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching, and I will see you later on.